about to take a road trip and there is a pigeon in my car. What are you doing here, buddy? Why are you in my car? But you can stay if you want, I guess. So this little bird is still in the car, the little pigeon. He's back here. He picked the right car to get into because I'm going south and it's about to get cold for winter, so this little guy, he knows what he's doing, I think. I think he knows I'm going south. Arrival, five hours, 15 minutes. I opened the door where he was sitting and he didn't want to get out before I left. And then I stopped for gas a few times and I opened the door, the driver's doors, and he didn't want to go out the driver doors either. I'll let him loose when I get there if he wants to. If not, he can hang out. Let's see if he wants to get out. Come out. You want to stay in the corner? I was afraid of that. I gotta let you out, man. Take that leap of faith. There you go. I'm back in the car. Look at that. I got a new friend. This is the first model made out of paper and barbecue skewers. And I'm currently making a second model twice as big to test out in the water with a little sail. Looks like the boat I want to build here. Alright, there we go. Top is on. It's a pretty little craft. I think it's going to look good in the water. A little sail on it. The model's almost done. I'm about ready to put it in the water. i got to paint it first, but it's looking pretty good. Here's my pigeon eating. Get your biscuits, smidgen. Eat your food. Looks pretty good using the exact same materials I'll be doing the real boat with. It's a high quality primer water based. I think it's acrylic latex but this will be the first step on the real boat as well. There is the paint job. Came out pretty good. Went with that gray deck. Putting all the pieces on here. This is called friction tape, and uh, comes on a roll like that. It's not super sticky, but what it does is it allows things to rub and not ruin the surface. So put that on there. That'll be in real life as well, most likely. There it is. 
is ready for the water. That's how you change direction. The little boat worked pretty well considering the wind was extremely light and I was fighting a current that was pushing the boat back to land in the inlet where I was testing. But it did seem to make some pretty good forward progress and I think it's going to be a good design. Thanks for tuning in to my channel. It's been a fun experience for me and hopefully for you too. It's always about trying to live the best life you can, get up every day and fight to survive and I appreciate it if you subscribe it helps me stay on the net creating things for you to watch Zacharias P. Lobish out have a good day